Welcome to our Excel Essentials video. In this tutorial, I'll show you most basics that you'll need in your day-to-day -day life for using Microsoft Excel. I'll be using Excel 365 version for this video. Although there might be slight differences in versions that you use, but 95% of the content would be same and you would be able to follow. So let's get started with the Excel basics. Today I will explain you the basic workbook elements. So this over here on the left top is the menu bar. You have different menus like home, insert, page layout, formulas and each of them are really important. So when you click on one of the tabs, it displays you a variety of options. These options are divided into various sections and each section is given a unique name. So like this is a table section which has three pivot table and table options. This is the charts section which has various chart options. Likewise, each of the tab has various sections and each section has various options. So this is called the menu bar and this is called the ribbon area. You can see here, this is called the ribbon area. When we move a slide down, this is called the formula bar where all your formulas would appear and this is called the name box. We will come to it later what a name box is and why it is used. Below that we have the worksheet area which has columns and rows. Excel has, so if you see the column are named as A, B, C, D in alphabets and they go up to XFD which is 16,384 columns in Excel and likewise 1,048,576 rows. Now if you wonder how did I scroll through this then let me tell you. In Excel you have various navigation keys so you would be able to find arrows in your keypad you can simply press Ctrl and right arrow to move to the last column in Excel and Ctrl and down arrow key to move to the last row in Excel. Again Ctrl and left, Ctrl and up. So this is how you can navigate through the corners in your worksheet. Now what am I clicking on this? What is this called? So this is a cell, a combination of row and a column is called a cell. Now currently I am on this cell and the name of the cell is displayed in the name box. So this is where name box comes into the picture. This cell is at the intersection of E column and second row. Hence the name is E2. When I move to this, this becomes H2. Likewise, when you select many cells, it becomes a range. Now, you, you can also find the scroll bar over here which will allow you to scroll up and down the worksheet and right and left in the worksheet. If you see below here, you have option to zoom. So when I zoom, I can see the worksheet in a more clear way and a better way. If you see at the left bottom, you have something named as sheet 1. So when I click on the plus button here, it adds a new sheet. So a collection of sheets is called a workbook. And now this is what a workbook is. So this was a basic interface of Excel elements. See you in the next video with a more detailed view of how Excel can help us in our day to day life. Thank you for watching.